what exactly is big data and are we how are we dealing or do we actually dealing are we dealing with big data and mining i mean i have had polar opposite views on this brian and we actually found a um a definition again gartner is a great source online they publish all sorts of things so we found this interesting um definition there big data is high volume high velocity and high variety of data so how does that do you think we are dealing with big data and mining or yeah we, yeah so it's an interesting question you know if you look at Gardner's definition there high volume high velocity and high variety you know uh, most people coming from the mining industry you'll know that a lot of the data especially data used in the counting systems and things like that is is basically you know shiftly daily uh, so it's it's point data you know it's not um, it's generally not not big data sets and also you know if you start going into the scale of all your sensors and things like that it can get high you know at, at the amount of data or the volumes but if you look at the instantaneous generate point generation um, amounts of data it's not really that high you know in terms of velocity 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 is definitely there in terms of certain sensing capabilities and then and the variety you know that's where it gets interesting because i think mining is a is a prime example of we you, you have data coming from all sorts of uh, different sources you know you've got sensors you've got um, weightometers you've got uh, manual inputs coming from assay data and things like that so you know in in a certain sense it, you'd say that you know mining is not big data but then if you look at the analysis of the data typically you know what you would expect um, is that for you to start doing forecasting on models or to do uh, analysis of, of, of what happened in the past, you know, then you start expanding it into, into time series. And as soon as you start doing that, then that, that low, relatively low amount of volume gets very high volume very quickly. So in that sense, it actually does turn into big data.